Welcome to Cadenet TV. We're pleased to be joined today by Andrew Pickerskill, the partner of McKinsey and & Company and leading innovation executive. Andrew, uh, we were very interested uh, in reading your report, I'll just hold it up here, Breaking Away from the Pack. It's quite timely because we're, we're debating now competitive issues in Canada, we're looking at public policies. I wonder if you could give us a bit the reasoning behind writing this report. What's the context? Sure. McKinsey & Company about 12 months ago decided to take a close look at the issue of competitiveness. Competitiveness in Canada, um, why? Uh, we're seeing, uh, when we look at our clients around the world, an explosion of growth in, uh, in global trade. And increasingly, Canadian companies are having to go ahead, head-to-head uh, -head against the world's best. And we felt like the debate on how Canadian companies are really competing with those best companies out there around the world was a little, uh, there could be a richer fact base on it. And so we took some time to try and add uh, some examples of what other countries are doing, uh, some real understanding of the dynamics and some sectors that really compete against the world's best uh, to try and contribute to this debate around competitiveness. So in addition to that background, I was very interested in your, uh, your chapter three because it dealt with some general action areas that organizations could really wrap their heads around in looking at how they can play, play a role in improving our performance. Can you just touch briefly on some of those action areas? Well, it's very clear that Canada needs to do more in the world of innovation. Innovation is at the core of competitiveness uh, and the Canadian companies uh, need to do a better job at trying to uh, respond to big changes in, in, in global supply chains, uh, start to compete in uh, high growth pockets of the market, and that the public sector could do more in terms of creating the conditions for more innovation amongst Canadian companies. We looked at three parts uh, of the innovation cycle, from developing with new ideas, to diffusing those ideas into real business opportunities, and then to scaling them. And in each of those three, there is clear, clear opportunity for private companies in Canada, as well as the public sector to work together uh, to try and accelerate that cycle of innovation in this country. And I guess CADA and, and, and yourselves will be working uh, together to engage uh, organizations in this creative discussion. So I want to, uh, I want to thank you for joining us today. I think it's, uh, it's an excellent piece of research and I think it will get us uh, one step closer to creating that innovation nation. Andrew, thank you very much. Thank you.